Hello, everybody. All right, today I'm going to show you how to access Adobe Animate from home if you are on a Chromebook or a laptop from home. So first thing you're going to do is log into your Northside portal. Once you get into your Northside portal, you should see a button that looks just like this, AWS at the top. This is how we're going to be accessing Adobe from home. So we're going to click on that. All right, now you're gonna get this screen and it's gonna ask you to choose your app. So for today's purposes, I'm gonna choose Adobe Animate, uh, but there will be times when we may use Adobe Illustrator or uh, maybe even Adobe Audition a little bit this year, so. All right, if you get a pop-up like this, go ahead and click Allow. And it will take some time to load, so we're just gonna let it load real quick. All right, and now that your uh, system is loaded, you'll get a screen that looks kind of like this. You're going to log in with your student email address. I'm going to log in with my teacher email address. And then you'll click continue. All right, when you get this pop up, you're going to click company or school account. And then you're going to go ahead and log into the portal. All right. If you get a pop-up screen like this, uh, it means that you're logged into too many uh, devices. So you can just click one to sign out of. Uh, I'm going to sign out of this one. And I'm going to click continue. All right. Uh, if you get this pop up screen, go ahead and click no. OK, uh, this pop up screen is going to show you if you want to, you can go ahead and watch it. But it's just going to show you around animate a little bit. Um, but I'm going to be giving you plenty of tutorials to work through. So we'll click no. All right. Uh, now, once you get into here, you're going to want to click create new. All right. And then your very first lesson will start right here. Uh, I hope this you guys found this tutorial to be helpful uh, and I'll see you uh, and uh, good luck on your first assignment. OK, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to save your files so that they save to your Google Drive, which is where we want everything to save. We don't want to uh, be saving things um, within this session because what will happen is uh, if you don't save your files correctly, you're going to lose all of your work and we don't want that to happen. So we're going to go to my files right here up in the top corner. Go ahead and click on that. And right here, you're going to see this button called add storage. Go ahead and click on that. And you're going to see right here, there is an option for Google Drive. Click on that. And then you're going to click whichever one is yours. You are students, so you will use the at students.nist.net. I am a teacher, so I'm going to use the at nist.net. I will click on here. I will click on my account. OK, it's going to ask me, do you want to give Amazon AppStream uh, access to your Google account? Yes, I do. So I'm going to click allow. And now you're going to see right in here, I have a folder for my Google Drive, okay? So um, now let me show you uh, how we save things. So from here, once you've got this imported, you can go ahead and exit out. And then you're gonna go to File, Save As. All right, and if I open this up, look, I have a Google Drive folder, all right? So you're gonna wanna click on this PC, all right? You're going to want to click on your Google Drive folder, and then you're going to want to go to My Drive. I suggest, guys, that in your My Drive folder, you go ahead and create a folder for your Animate lessons, okay? So I'm just going to save it right into My Drive, and I'm going to keep the name 
uh, 01 end and click save. Okay, I actually already have this file in here, so it's gonna ask me if I wanna replace it, I'm gonna click yes. All right, and it saved that file. So now let's go take a look at our Google Drive and see if it's in there. So I'm gonna go to Google Drive and in here, I'm just gonna type in 01 end and there you go, guys, that is my file right there. So when I'm in Schoology, all I need to do is attach a Google Drive file. Uh, I only, all I need to do is attach this file from my Google Drive and turn it in. All right, so let's go ahead and exit out of this. Let's say we did some work and we finished our project. So we go ahead and exit out. We just saved the file. Now we need to reopen the file because we need to make some changes to it. Same thing, guys. You're gonna go up here. You're gonna make sure that you've connected that Google Drive and then you're gonna to go to open. All right, I'm in that Google Drive. I'm gonna to go to my drive. All right, and then I'm gonna find that file. And right there, there it is, that 01 in FLA. I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna click open. And here you go, guys, here is my file. And if we go ahead and run it real quick, you'll see that everything is here exactly the way it should be. So there you go, file is complete, ready to go. So I could make changes to this. Maybe I wanna uh, move this star up a little bit and then I could go ahead and click uh, file, save.